This is Simple Touch. It's a synthesizer that you can build on your own. And in this first episode, I'll give you an overview of what it is. In the coming videos, we're going to show all sorts of instruments you could make out of this. Let's get to it. Simple Touch runs the Daisy Seed microcontroller, which means you could create all sorts of musical instruments with it. It also has a touch sensor that allows you to create all sorts of touch interaction with your instrument. It has two faders, and what you see here is four potentiometers, but you could add up to six. These could also be switches if you prefer switch interaction. And it has stereo in and stereo out in super high fidelity. Putting this kit together could take about one half hour, maybe two hours. If you've never soldered before, check out our video course about soldering. It's certainly not rocket science. It's a bunch of components that you need to connect to the board, solder them together, and simply flash some code. The goal is to allow you to design your own instruments with this. This is just one of the designs, and on GitHub we have lots of instruments you could upload on the DAISY. All projects by community members who you could watch explain their code on our YouTube channel. We're going to work with all sorts of artists to create different designs. It is Eurorack compatible, although I'm actually just running it on USB power now. You could connect a Eurorack power with a couple of components and pretty much run this as a Eurorack module as well. For now, I'm just pretty excited that this prototype arrived and you could grab one in our shop. Synthuex Academy is a non-profit and all the revenue that comes from these projects goes directly into creating more content, educational content and supporting the community. So go to the Synthuex Academy website and grab one. You'll also get access to the video course we released earlier this year. So you could learn how to program your own synth Join Discord to meet other makers, musicians, artists, engineers who are in the space and collaborating on different instruments and make some noise. Don't forget to like and subscribe because in the next episodes we're going to show all sorts of instruments that were made with this board and teach you how to build them. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.